Hey guys, Max here, and today I want to talk about music for your films. Now I think we all know the importance and impact a soundtrack can make on a movie, a short film, or just a tech video. I myself have recently started to use music in the background of my tutorials. Even right now, you can hear music playing in the background of this video. Like it? I hope so. So the word stock makes people cringe. Stock footage, or stock audio in this case, has a bad reputation of being unoriginal, a waste of time, or just sounding too commercially. Think literally sounding like stock audio. Imagine elevator music. But don't let this frighten you. Stock audio can be a wondrous addition to your arsenal of filmmaking to take your project to the next level, if selected and used correctly. I'm sure there are a number of short films and feature films that use stock audio. And of course they have original soundtracks. I'm not saying they don't. But there is no reason that we cannot take advantage of stock audio right now. So, I want to go over a few resources that I use every day to obtain stock audio gold. First off, we have one of my all-time favorites, Audio Jungle. I've used this site's resources on more than one occasion, and have spent countless hours combing the depths of the site for the perfect song. You can browse until your heart's content and browse some more, because you're going to filter through a lot of content that just sounds stocky. But don't let that discourage you, because Audio Jungle has some gems, and they have licensing options that will let you choose what fits your work the best and ultimately won't break the bank. Feel free to go to their popular page and see some of the site's top picks. You may recognize some of the music in some of your favorite YouTube videos as well. Secondly, we have YouTube's very own royalty-free stock page. And the best part about YouTube's stock page is that it's all free. You can find a lot of it via just searching YouTube as well. And if you don't recognize this sound, then you're probably born yesterday. I'll add a link in the description where to download it if you're interested. Most of the music allows you to freely use it and monetize your videos, while some only require you to put a reference in your description. So that's pretty darn cool. Now thirdly, we have marmosetmusic.com. It's a wonderful site with beautiful music. It's a little more expensive than Audio Jungle, but nonetheless has higher quality music in my opinion. When you find exactly what you're looking for, you can add it to your cart and select the licensing option of your choice. For instance, the independent film option is set on average at $199. So that is normally in the realm of possibilities for indie filmmakers. My fourth pick, fourth pick, is premiumbeats.com. It's quick and easy, and you can quickly find something that suits your work, and typically every song costs around $40 for YouTube, where you can monetize your video, and $250 per song for film and theatrical production. And overall, the quality of music is pretty high throughout the entire site. So, go check it out. Now, my fifth option is musicbed.com. I'm pretty sure we're on five. I think I lost count. It's definitely a great site to browse music if you have the budget. The compositions are of wonderful quality and will certainly impress you. Granted it's more expensive, but we can reserve this site for higher budget projects. I selected a couple different licensing options, and most of the options geared around $200. Now finally, my all-time favorite and definitely my most go-to site right now is www.art-list.io forward slash hashtag. Don't let that weird URL fool you. The site is hands down the best site for royalty-free music I've found so far, and let me tell you why. Number one, it has quality music. Every track has something special, and each one sounds like it was made with a purpose. Very indie feeling, and so far from the typical stock sound. Number two, the site has a yearly subscription fee of $199, with unlimited downloads. And if that sounds like a lot, just refer to some of the details I gave you before. Most songs cost around $40 to license per video, so if you make more than 5 videos a year for YouTube, you will easily spend more than $200 a year. Number 3. The site is brand new and recently on the market, and is very easy to use. Just find a song you like, hit the cart button, and check out. Once you do that, it will show up in your email ready to be downloaded and used in your project. Number 4. If you listen closely to the song in the background of this video, it was from www art-list.io forward slash hashtag and in my opinion it's a wonderful option for gathering music for your videos especially when you want to produce as many videos as I do 
So, go check it out. Other than that, I'm Max. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found this information helpful. I know I use this stuff every day, and it's always something to think about. I mean, I've spent countless hours where I knew what the project was, I knew what I was going to do for the video, and that part wasn't even hard. The hard part was just sitting for six hours combing through music sites and finding the perfect song. So it's good to have a couple of resources in your back pocket that'll let you find something quick and efficiently. But as always, please like and subscribe and leave a comment. I try to respond to everybody. There's not a lot of traffic on my videos right now, so responding isn't a big deal, and I like interacting. It's kind of a pet peeve of mine to just respond to everything. Hopefully it gets to a point where I can't manage it. Until then, I will do my best. That about wraps it up. I'll catch you next time, guys. Peace.